see me. All right, so this is um, the 12th vlog, and because life is life, and I'm clumsy as fuck, I just came from King Supers, and my clumsy ass turned around. I had my, my I brought my own bag, so I had my, my little basket and my bag. Unbeknownst to me, because I'm looking for something, and I'm like, hey, Matt, how many do you need? I'm looking for, he wanted a frozen dinner, so I'm like, okay. So I'm picking out, I, I find it, and I'm like, how many do you want? One, two, what? Um, do you want one for now, one for later, whatever? Do, okay. So unbeknownst to me, I don't see or notice that, you know, those big, um, th those boxes of the apple cider, yeah, right behind me. So I step back and move to the side and whoosh, they all go toppling to the ground, breaking into a million pieces. And so I hope I don't have glass in my hair. I don't, I don't feel any moisture. So I don't think any of the cider popped into my head. But you see, when my hair looks like this, it looks kind of like that wig that I bought. That's why I got it. Anyway, so yeah, so I made a big ass, huge mess in aisle 15 and I was like, oh, and some, so some guy, he's like Russian or something. He's like, oh, I'm sorry. Um, how can I help you? Oh, I didn't see it. And I'm like, did I do that? Or I, you didn't do that, right? It was me. And he was just like, I don't know. But, <laughs> and I was like, oh my God. Oh my God. So I run away and I'm like, hey. Um, there's a mess on 15, um, glasses everywhere, cider is everywhere, and they're like, oh, okay, so then they call somebody, and I'm like, oh, shit, let me run away. I'm so embarrassed. I'm like, of course this would happen to me. Of course it would happen to me. Merry Christmas to Bia. <sighs> but anyway, all right, so, do you like your Christmas bone? Do you like your Christmas bone? Obviously you do. Where's your other toy? Get it! Yeah. Merry Christmas! Merry Christmas! Oh, oh! Hey! Come back! Bobo! Look! Look! Get it! Fetch it up! Get it! Fetch it up! You are a foo biscuit. Plunk. Merry Christmas, booger. That's supposed to light in the dark. I need to figure out how to get them to light in the dark. Unless it just like needs to like, I don't know. Oh, y'all see his toy? It glows in the dark. Cool. Awesome. <laughs> yeah, his toe, his toe, his toy does glow in the dark. So now we know where the hell you are when you're playing with it. And when, so we're not stepping on it. Bopus, look, look. Ah! Good boy. Crazy pup. You are such a freaking weirdo. I got my toys! I got my toys! Mm. I got my toys! Look, mommy, I can fit them both in my mouth. I got my toys! Meh. Little freaking weirdo. Stop trying to carry them both at once, fool! Hey, you guys. So, I... This is, what, day 13 or something of my um, vlogs. And I don't know how to do this. <laughs> so that it'll set up and not, like, fall over somewhere. Okay. So, can you see me? Cool. All right. So, I am making jollof rice. And I have beef on the stove right there. 
Um, I was going to go and pick up some goat, but I got tired and was like, you know what, I'm going to run. I'm just going to miss going to the African shop today. So I blended some tomatoes, some onions, some ginger, um, a habanero, and did I say garlic already? <laughs> well, I um, blended those together, and I'm just going to pour it over. And just cook that in there until the meat gets tender and then I'm gonna fry it and make my stew because that's what we're having for dinner jollof rice so yeah. this, this dog so that is my plan I just got back from the store I had to finish putting stuff away I had to go and give Matt some love because he's not feeling very well um, and uh, yeah so hopefully you guys can see me I don't know um, it's kind of weird but I'm gonna stir it up so you guys see what it looks like and then I'll be back when the I also added some salt and I need to add this I'm gonna pack it to it so I'm do that Joker playing in the background. I've never seen it. I've heard it was a really good movie, but have yet to see it. So, I will leave ow, ow, the directions of what all I do in the description box. So, if you guys want to try it out yourselves, you can. So, I'm just let this cook. Let the beef cook until it's tender, and then I'm going to fry it and start working on my stew. I haven't made this in a long time. The last time I made it, I was married, and I don't know, it just never came out right. But now I found a recipe that actually does, it shows me what I'm supposed to do, because, I don't know, my ex never really helped me. He was like, you're, you're he never said I was doing it wrong, but it always came out like not the greatest. I don't know, but ah, with this recipe, it should come out fairly well. So. That's what it's looking like. So I'm just okay. So I got distracted because I got a phone call, and then I just started adding stuff. So <laughs> okay, so this is how it's looking. And so, in there, I don't know if I can do this without popping myself full of lid. Um, so, there's half carrots, green beans, bell peppers in there. I have my fried beef right there. I have my onions over there. And when the oil gets to sit on the top of this oil, um, I'm going to add my onion and my meat, let that cook for a few minutes or about 15 minutes, and then I'm going to drain that rice. I need to rinse it off some more, but then I'm going to add that to it and then put it on simmer and just let it do its magic, baby. So I'll let you see what it looks like. Oh, my hands are all sticky. I'm cleaning out the fridge, so throwing a whole bunch of nasty crap away that's smelling. So, um... That is what I'll do. So we'll let it. All right, y'all. So I've added the onions and the meat. I had to pull out the anise because I didn't want to like chew on it because I don't really know what that tastes like, even though it's like a fennel -y, I believe it's fennel based or something, or that's what you make fennel out of. I'm not quite sure. <laughs> but yeah, there's that. So that's how it looks stirred up. That looks good. And it smells so good in here. It smells like ginger. <clears throat> I can't wait to add the rice. I haven't had jollof roast in so long. Oh, I hope I don't fuck it up, but because <laughs> I always make the stews really well, but then like my ex used to put it, um, like put it in the oven and I, I don't know. I don't know, but yeah, if I can just do it here and like not let it burn, that will be freaking awesome. All right, y'all. So 
I added the rice and that is what it looks like. So it just has to cook. I have it set on timer and I'll stir it shortly. Um, let some of that rice absorb the juice. And while I go and take this dog out to go potty, I had to take some of the stew out because it was a little too much, but yeah. But oh, this nut looks so good. Mm, yummy, yummy, yummy. I can't wait. I'm so excited. And then I added a cup of water to it. And that's another cup just in a moment. All right, so that is what it's looking Maybe like. Maybe after dinner you two could go for a ride or something. So it needs to cook a little bit longer, but yeah, that's looking pretty good. Hey you guys, so I don't know if you can see me. So I just trimmed my hair. It doesn't look like it, but <laughs> I totally need to like get my hair done because it is uh, 8.35 p.m. I'm going to be up for a while. So I redid my pre-poo and I need to shake it up a little bit more. Um, yeah. And what I decided to do, because I haven't tried my carrot juice stuff yet, what I'm going to do is I'm going to mix the carrot with my pre-poo in the glass. So I'm going to put that on my hair and hopefully I don't die. Let me show you what it looks like. Woo! So instead of spraying it on, I'm just gonna like. And because my finger is slippery, I turned off the camera. So, yeah. So, ooh! Thick, thick, thickness, thick. So, I'm gonna. I think some of the honey is still trying to like not mix. Bad honey, bad, 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 bad. All right, let me pour some out. And that way I'll be able to mix it a little bit better. Um, ah. And Bo is over here thinking I'm making something for him. <laughs> no fool, this is for my hair. <laughs> ah. So, Today I've been super busy. I made, um, I made the jollof rice. Um, took out the trash because I cleaned out our fridge and got all sorts of nasty stuff out of there. My boob fell out. That was super embarrassing. Ugh, it was horrible. I had my jacket closed and it just unzipped because I dropped the trash because this little douche nugget. I want to take him out and take the trash at the same time and this Hispanic guy comes walking by and instead of him behaving like a good little tiny teenager this fool decides I'm gonna jump on this this person of color so I had to drop um, the the trash bag and in the process of bending over to grab him my my jacket opened and because this is what I was wearing underneath my jacket, I went to bend over and bloop. Thank God no one was around when that happened or no one else was around. And I don't think that guy saw it because he was on his phone. He wasn't paying attention. But I was like, oh, my God. Really? So kudos for an indecent exposure. Ugh, this dog is gonna just see it's like down at the bottom I don't know why it's like trying to do that I don't know why it's like you can't have none number one it's honey you'll definitely have diarrhea and then like today it's been like a hassle I have to go and get this fool some dog food from Petco um, because we order his his uh, uh, food it's like a special like kinetics or something and we were supposed to actually get it last week because it's automatically shipped to us and it's still in the factory or at the dock or wherever at UPS and so the guy that Matt spoke to was like yeah well how about this um, I'll just go ahead and like you know send it out to you and you'll get it like 
by Saturday. And it's like, uh, we're not going to be here and he needs food. So I had to run over to Pet Cow and this honey just does not want to like, I don't know what's happening. Huh. But let me just pour some in. Okay. That, okay. It doesn't want to pour. It's being all thick and shit. <sighs> all right. <laughs> this is going to be interesting. So I will show y'all what the carrot looks like after I get it all mixed up. But yeah, so, um, I had to go over there and buy his food and it's got like little pieces of like chicken in it or something like that. It looks pretty tasty, but you know, well, for dog food, I guess, but all right. Let's see if I can mix this up without making a freaking mess. Carrot pre -poo. Oh. Got some momentary hair loss. <laughs> Looks like I heard a beep in my ear. That's interesting. That's not good. And I've been like on my feet all freaking day. I'm so tired. <sighs> and then having to like do my hair and like Matt's not feeling good. I'm like, this may, I may have to stay here. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> All right. So, I don't know. Let me add a little bit more. And it's not freezing anymore because I have my carrot juice in the refrigerator. So it's like room temperature now. So my head isn't going to like, you know, freeze to death. And then I did some pre-poo for um, a lady friend of mine. She paid for it. And she was like, oh my God, I love how my hair feels. Thank you so much. I'm like, you're welcome. You're welcome. Helping a sister out one hit at a time. All right, so this is what it looks like. Yay! And it's still really freaking thick, but that's good. So yeah, so I'm gonna put this in my head, and ooh, I will show y'all what it looks like and how it feels. All right, y'all. So I got it in my hair, and that's what it's looking like. I'm going to leave it in for about, I don't know, 20 minutes or so, 15, 20 minutes. Matt's in the shower right now, so that'll give me some time to just, like, wait it out. Um, I don't know, my scalp, like, the center of my, my scalp right there, oh, my God, it smells so bad. But, yeah, I mean, it doesn't smell bad now because I have that on there, but I really, 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 like... <sighs> I don't know. Hopefully I don't lose too much hair because I did when, um, trimming my hair. I, lo I lost about, I don't know, that much, that much hair. I mean, I, it's in the trash. I can show you guys, but anyway. Um, but yeah, so, um, it's like itching a little bit on my scalp, like over here. And I'm pretty sure it's the carrot. So I may not be spraying this on my hair, like, during the week and, like, leaving it like that woman said, but <clears throat> maybe on my wash day, I'll do it to just give it that extra, like, you know, and be using my carrot oil and stuff, but I don't know, this itching, it'll be driving me crazy, uh, and I don't know how to spray it on my hair without getting it on my scalp, you know what I mean? It just never happens. What? It's a piece of carrot. I don't know if y'all can see it on my nail. No, you can't see it. Wait, there, you see it? Tiny piece of carrot. Kind of mess. <laughs> I hope I don't like leave tiny pieces of carrot. See, there's a tiny piece right there. Anyway, that means I probably have to strain it again. But anyway, yeah, um, so I got my friend her Christmas present and I potted it for her. It's so pretty. Look at that. such an interesting looking plant and I got myself one too it's over here his little toy glows in the dark he that's his, his Christmas present he um, um he had two but he destroyed the other one already and then that's mine 
that's got like two little horns on it that's cool huh and then I like I got this one today too that little one because I had one from a friend of mine and it died I was like ah, what so I'm all super upset a poor plant and then like my my um I need to get some more of the um what do you call them ah oh, I don't remember it's not a palm it's a it's it's a bamboo yeah something like that I need to get one of those another one of those um but yeah anyway so my hair is all kind of orangey <laughs> but that's from the carrot just hope it doesn't like dye my hair and I doubt it will though so, because I mean even though if I did eat a whole shitload of carrots my skin and my fingers would start turning uh, orange so but anywho I will get this rinsed out and then let y'all know how it feels when I'm done with my entire wash day when I'm done with my entire wash day I will let you guys know this camera is doing that weird thing again so I'm going to have to do some serious editing. But anyway, I will talk to y'all later. Okay, you guys. So I got it in. And after I rinsed out the carrot and stuff, my hair was so super soft. I was like, wow. This is a maze ball. So I think I'm going to probably be doing that from now on. <laughs> and my hair really needed a washing. And this is like the first time ever that I actually shampooed my hair twice because I don't ever do that, but I, it needed it. But I didn't like get too much fallout, so yay. Hey y'all, so I am going to try on this wig today. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta like moisturize my hair real quick. Since I did it, it's all flat from yesterday. Um, I didn't actually get done with my hair until like 1.40 in the morning. Not fun, but it had to be done. But, look at the fatness. <laughs> but it's okay, I'm getting rid of it. Um, eating my salads and doing it you know doing portion control and stuff like that and doing my squats and my Zumba and my other exercises and it'll come off it'll take a minute but it will come off and you know I know I'll get discouraged but I won't stop because I'm not a quitter when it comes to things that I'm passionate about or people I care about I don't quit that's one of my faults. One of my biggest faults. <laughs> but, alright. Alright. I don't think it really matters if I get a little bit of oil on this. Alright, let's hope. This isn't a, a complete flop. Let me see if I can figure out how to... Alright. Take that off. Protection. Matt was like, why'd you get wigs if you have to put the hairnet on? I'm like, to protect them, fool. <laughs> All right. Wait, there's a hair caught in there. All right. <laughs> I feel so stupid. <laughs> All right, let me make sure it's, I found the little clasp thing at the foot the bottom of it. Let me open it all the way up because for my big old head. <sighs> Alright y'all. I may have to take out these clips because I don't want them to pull my hair but here goes nothing. <laughs> Alright. Eek. my my actual hair in there.
how. Yeah, this. I'm not gonna worry about my twists down there because they just kind of blend in. You see how it, oh, can you see my twists? They just kind of blend in. All right, let me see. This is ridiculous. <laughs> All right. <laughs> I look like I've got a big ass forehead. I know some girls who wear wigs all the time and their forehead looks like it's way back here. It's so odd. What is that? Do, I mean, you can see my hairline, yes? Let me see if I can make it look a little bit more natural. I don't know. <laughs> right, I'm going to have to like adjust and get my other hair under there. Hold on. This is so funny. Oops. You can't even see me. You see my, my stomach. Um. <laughs> this is so ridiculous. Uh, this is so funny. Alright. Because my hair, I mean, this is the hair goal to have my hair like this poofy and stuff, but my hair ain't this poofy. I mean, it could be if it's. You know, and these are like, th these curls are all bouncy and shit. My hair ain't this bouncy yet. I don't know. <laughs> I'm, <just> like, <laughs> I'm all snorting and shit. This is hilarious. Okay. Alright. Maybe if I, I don't know, maybe if I put like a clip on one side, so... I mean, I'm pretty sure it's kind of like, I don't know. It doesn't look too bad, right? I mean, if you didn't know me, you're probably, I mean, it looks like a wig. I mean, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe I could... Oh, that's what I can do. That's what I can do. Let me get some pins. Let me get some pins. Okay, so <laughs> I got these little hairpins. If I use the hairpins, maybe it'll look more believable. Let's see. So two that match. So I'll use these ones and see. All right. <laughs> All right. Put this one here. Ah, that's pulling my hair. Wait. That's actually pulling my real hair. Alright. So, I'll put this... Ah! What is happening? Oh, that's why. This has got, like, some weird little thing on the end. It's, like, pulling my hair. Ooh, I'm not going to use that. Alright, next. <laughs> Alright, um... Uh, fuck it. I'll use the purple ones. They don't have those things on them. Alright, so let's see. I'll clip this one. And then I'll clip this one <laughs> over here. Oops. Okay, it popped out. Hold on, wait. Oh, it popped out again. Alright, this is not working. Alright. Try and get the curl so the curl can kind of lay over my hair. Aha! There we go. Alright. <laughs> Alright. What does that look like? I mean, that's a little believable, right? I mean, my, my curls, when I untwist my hair my hair kind of looks like this right like a little bit I mean I wish it felt like this because these are really soft but anybody who feels my hair they they know it's way coarser than this way more coarser than this but I mean I have um I have these I bought all these and I have yet to use them so I the new year 
I'm going to start using these. So my hair can come out more like this, hopefully. <laughs> and I did, um, I trimmed my hair last night. Oh, I meant to show you um, how much, unless um, it's been covered up. Hold on. <laughs> yeah, it's been covered up. Okay, never mind. <laughs> All right, but anyway, so the ball, the ball of hair that I lost during my wash routine and through trimming was about this much. So that's not a lot. That's actually really good. And like, um, like after my wash day, during my wash day, um, the little ball that I had during styling and everything was about this big, less than this. It was about that big. I was like, oh, that's cool. So, yeah. But, yeah. <laughs> I'm going to wear this to work and see if my my client can tell the difference. I mean, what do y'all think? What do you look like in the back? Are my twists exposed? <laughs> oh, shit. All right. Let me go and show Maxwell. I mean, ooh. Matt. Oh, my God. Whoops. Let me go and show Matt. <laughs> you talking about me? Anyway. Um, and then, what time is it? I think I gotta get to work. So I'm not late. So, all right, well, <laughs> let me get out of here. He's in a meeting, but I don't think he's on video, so he can look at me without going, you know, his people he works with looking at me, so. All right, y'all, my first day wearing a wig. This is going to be interesting. Super interesting. All right, I'm going to take some pictures and put it on Facebook and see if anybody can tell that it's a wig or if they're like, oh, my God, your hair is so pretty. It's gotten so long. I'm going to see if I can fool some people. So I'll tell y'all about that later. <laughs> All right.